skate park. So Eddie, how long have you been skateboarding? Uh, I've been skating for about a year now. Actually, this month I've been skating a year. What made you want to start skateboarding? Um, actually, I don't know. It's always been like something I wanted to get into. And I guess I just took it up last year. Do you, do you practice often? Yeah, I'm at the skate park every day. What do you think of the town trying to close the skate park? Uh, I think it's unnecessary because, I don't know, the skate park, a lot of people skate now, so it wouldn't be smart to take it away. Would you be upset if they try to close it? Yes, actually I'll be really upset. And I think a lot of people will start skating places that aren't skatable, like places people can't skate, so yeah. Do you think it's a waste of money to try to fix the skate park? Actually, no, it's, I don't think it's a waste of money because we need more stuff in the skate park. It's a pretty small skate park, but it'd be worth it. Have you ever been in a competition before? Um, one. Didn't win, though. Where would you skate if the, if the skate park was closed? Probably the center. A couple sets. I don't know. I'll probably try to go to Junction or Academy, but that costs money, so. How do people view you as a skater? Some people view me like, I don't know, in the wrong way. But some people like view me okay. I guess it's not a problem. How about the residents, like the, the people of the town? How do you think they view you? Uh, they view me as like a bad kid, probably some, most of the time. As a kid that does bad stuff because I'm a skater. I don't know. That's pretty much how they see me as. Who inspires you to skate? Um, I don't know. My brother kind of inspired me to do it because at first I wasn't going to do it and then I asked him and he just told me to go for it, so. Are you good? Uh, I'm all right. Do you want to continue skateboarding in the future? Yeah. I want to go for a long time. Thank you, Eddie, for taking the time to be with us. We have Kyle Prevost with us at the skate park. So Kyle, how long have you been skateboarding? For like probably about four years, almost five years. What made you want to start skateboarding? Um, I don't know. Actually, I just wanted to stay out of trouble and it was something to do. It wasn't like one thing that made me want to start. Do you practice often? I practice just about every day. What do you think of the town trying to close the skate park? Um, I think it's a shame because I think this place is a really great place to um, get away from like all the adults hassling you about, um, you know, being a skateboarder, just trying to have fun. So I think it's terrible that they're trying to close the place. What do you think would happen if they did close the skate park? I think everybody would go out and try to skate places, you know, where they complain is a no skate zone. And I think that more cop calls would be made and I think people would be getting into trouble. Do you think it's a waste of money to fix the skate park? I don't think it's a waste of money. I just think that we need to get people to realize that it's not a waste of money. And a lot of people see it as being a waste of money. I don't think it's a waste of money. Have you ever competed in a skate park? Yeah, they have contests here at Windsor Skate Park, and it's fun. Do you think the town respects skaters? Me? I don't know. I don't think a lot of people, I don't think the town knows me, but I think as a whole, the skateboarders, I don't think they see them as a very great group of people, so I don't think they respect us at all. How do people view you as a skater? I have no idea. I, I really don't know how people view me as a skateboarder, but I think a lot of people think we're rebels. Who inspires you to skate? Um, I think just having something to do. I mean, I'd rather skate and get exercise and be healthy than go and sit on my couch or go on the computer for five hours a day, you know? So like, I think just being fit and healthy is what inspires me to skate. What do you do when you fail? When I fall, you mean? Yeah. When I fall? I don't know, I kind of, sometimes I just lay there and I kind of think about what I did wrong and I try to fix it. Do you want to keep on continuing skateboarding? Mm. I think probably once I get out of high school, I'll have other things to do. And I mean, I'd love to try to keep skateboarding, but I don't think it's going to be a possible, you know, possibility because I mean, I just get too many injuries and stuff. 
Thank you, Kyle, for taking the time to be with us.